Hey guys, Marshall from Going Gear Shot Show 2017 in Las Vegas, here with Addison from Industrial Revolution, which is probably a name that a lot of people don't recognize, <laughs> but uh, they recognize yeah, the yeah. brands. So what brands do you guys do? Yeah, so here at the show, we're, rep we're representing Morikaneve and Yuko. Is that how it's actually pronounced? Morikaneve, yeah, that's yeah. correct. Yeah, we actually have uh, representatives on site from Mora, and they're, they're very quick to correct us if we get it wrong. Yeah, Morikaneve. No light my fire? We have Light My Fire here as well, but we're kind of pared down to a small showing. Uh, we do have Light My Fire represented in the front, um, but the main stories we're talking about with the new product is with Mora Kniev and Yuko. And then you also got do uh, Esbit. I'm just looking at the logos that are around here. Yay Labs and Tova. Yeah, yeah. So we've, we've got about five brands. Um, some of the products aren't particularly shoot, uh, suited to the shop market. So like I said, I mean, we, we have probably a thousand SKUs yeah. that we keep in our warehouse, so very pared down. Um, so we're talking new gear that's come out from uh, Yuko and Mora Kniev at this show. Okay. I don't think I'm going to get used to you saying it like that. Mora <laughs> Kniev, yeah. yeah, it sounds, well, Mora Knives, if yeah, that's a better go. way, a little bit go. more suited. Yeah, yeah. Okay, let's start with Yuko. Totally. All right, do you want me to take the mic? Take oh. the mic? Cool, yeah. you got it, you got it. Cool, so we're going to start here. Um, brand new in stock for us, what we have is the Rodi. Uh, the Rodi is a small LED lantern with a twist style dial. Um, I don't know if you can zoom in, but that's actual wood on the inlay. Uh, so this guy, what's, what's really unique about this entire line of LED lights is we wanted to elevate the light much like you'd expect from your home. Sure. So too many times you're camping and your light is on the table in front of you. It doesn't matter if it's 100 lumens, 500 lumens, you're gonna be blinding yourself or you're setting it right between you and the person you're trying to interact with. So we thought, why not lift it up off the ground like the lighting we have in here, like the lighting we have in our homes so that you can kind of have a wider uh, breadth of illumination and just get the harsh light out of your eyes. So what we have here is a, a magnetic hockey puck lanyard for lack of a better term. And so what you do is you pull this off, you can girth hitch this just around like a tree branch, a tent pole, whatever you need it to be, get it up, get it out of your eyes. Super strong magnet, and there you go. Um, like I said, dial light, it's got a blue light as well. Um, and we're What's the purpose of the blue? Purpose of the blue is just to offer a, a, a slightly less offensive light, much like you would have a, um, a red light on a headlamp. Something where it'll still illuminate, but you're not gonna get uh, the glare in someone else's eyes, or if you're looking at a map, you're not gonna get the glare back in your own eyes. Totally. So moving on from the roadie, um, we're going to take a look at the Madrona. Uh, this is the Madrona here. Um, obviously a little bit larger, so we go from uh, 130 lumens to 300 lumens. Once again, twist knob, goes all the way, super bright. Uh, real wood on the inlay. And so you'll notice here, um, the last one, the roadie, was white, and this particular one is black. Um, if you see this in white, it, it runs off an alkaline battery. If you see it in black, it is a lithium ion rechargeable battery. Okay. So, you can power in, you can power out. Um, What's the capacity on, on that? 4,400 milliamps. Okay. Yep, 4,400 milliamps. Um, like I said, this goes up to 300 lumens. Once again, the magnetic hockey puck style lanyard at the base. And this is the Madrona line. So the next up, this big boy, it's called the Sitka. Um, much like with the other ones, if it's black, we're doing a lithium ion. If it's white, we're doing alkaline battery. So this one, we took a little bit more unique style of lifting the light up off the ground. So with these, as you saw, we had magnetized it. With this, we have an extendable arm that lifts it 34 inches off the deck. And the light source is up high. So once again, if, if you're at a campsite and you need to uh, uh, like chop some veggies or you need to clean something, basically you need a working area beneath you. Um, you need something brighter than your average headlamp. You bring along the Sitka, you raise it up, and you're going to get a nice wide beam of light. Okay. And that goes up to uh, 500 lumens. Once again, it's available in an alkaline version or a lithium ion. And this one actually has um, a USB in and two USBs out. So keeping in line with our theory of lifting light up off the ground, we have a small collapsible flashlight and lantern all in one that we're calling the Leshi. So it comes with this shock cord mounting system to where we can wrap it around a branch, tent pole, anything you need to where you can lift light up off the ground and illuminate a key area or workspace. 
So it comes with three power settings and a strobe. Um, it powers up to 110 lumens. It all is powered from one single AA battery, and it's in a, uh, a durable aluminum casing. Nice. Yeah, yeah, really cool one for us. Really small, great for like an emergency pack or something. Pretty low retail on that too, right? Yeah, low retail at $14.99. Nice. Yeah, it's a good one. So we got a few new products going on in our fire starting uh, line as well. So first we have what we call the Firefly. The Firefly is a match case and flashlight all in one. So you've got a flashlight there. And in this water resistant case, we stash our uh, stormproof matches. It should hold 25 of these. Comes with uh, two strike pads and also a uh, bottle opener and a carabiner clip so you can take it on the go. Uh, next, what we have are two of our, uh, we're calling them torches. So basically, these are butane-powered torches. So you've got a waterproof top, triple jet butane lighter, and then on the back of this particular one, you've got a bottle opener. So we didn't get too creative with the name. The name is the torch and bottle opener. And over here... I, I was going to call you out. I'm glad you did it yourself. Thanks. I was going to say, I, I appreciate you looking out for us. Our, uh, uh, we could maybe get a little bit more creative with yeah. that one. <laughs> Uh, so what we have here is called the Torch and Tape. Once again, you're getting really creative with it. Butane triple jet, butane triple jet, water resistant top, and uh, we supply some duct tape around the outside. Next up, one that uh, we're really excited about is called the Sweet Fire. And so the Sweet Fire is made from a, a sugarcane byproduct called Bagas. You, you, don't have to take too much away from that other than we take something that was traditionally a waste, we pack it together, we add a little bit of wax and a striker tip, and each one of these individual triangles will burn for seven minutes at a time. So you strike it directly on the, on the box and you've got seven minutes of flame. Uh, it currently comes in a pack of 20 all nestled together and that retails for $5.99. So what we have here today is the flat pack portable grill. Uh, this is our mini version. So this is meant to cook for one to two people. So what this is is a stainless steel, fully collapsible grill. Um, it can be used as a grill with this, or you can leave it as an open fire pit. Um, as you can see, we have some ventilation on the side, so you can get some airflow in there to really get the coals going. Uh, I know I said coals, but it can actually burn wood as well. Um, and so what's really neat about this is the whole thing packs down totally flat and comes in at just over an inch thick. Um, great for packing away, stuff it in a pack, you can stuff it in your car, um, just truly a portable grill, which has been a big, um, um, a big request from some of our fans. In the past, we've done the flat pack for three to four people. This is meant for one to two. And it also comes in this handmade case. Um, and the whole price on this is gonna be $39.99 retail. Awesome. So what we have here is a collaboration between Mora Kniev, I'm still saying it right, Yuko, and the Pathfinder School. The Pathfinder School, by the way, is a, um, a, an organization that focuses on teaching survival and bushcraft skills. Uh, it's founded by Dave Canterbury, one of our ambassadors, and this whole kit was actually Dave's idea. Um, so what we have here is we have Dave's Bushcraft 101 book, which is a, a field guide on survival wilderness. Um, it's hit the New York Times bestseller list and uh, is a nice guide for someone who's looking to get into basically all things bushcraft and survival. Um, it also comes with our stormproof match kit here. Uh, it comes with the Sweet Fire fire starter, which is what we talked about earlier. The, you get seven minutes of burn time on each of those points, so you should have plenty of time to, fire to, to start a fire or you're probably doing it wrong and you probably need to read Dave's book a little bit more closely. So read the book first. Read the book first, highly encouraged. Uh, next we have the, uh, the Yuko Original Candle Lantern. I mean, we've been making that thing since 1971 and that is one of Dave's all-time favorites. Um, it comes with the Mora Kniev Cans Bowl, uh, which is an all-around outdoorsman's knife um, made for cleaning, skinning, can also be used with a fire steel, um, nice lightweight, just a perfect carrying option. Comes with a 32 ounce stainless steel bottle. Um, that's 32 ounces to the dot because uh, most common water purification systems are made for a full 32 ounce. So it's kind of dummy proof. You just fill it up, drop the tablet in, and you're set. Um, lastly, it comes with this, this pot that can be used to cook. Um, it also comes with a strainer. 
so that you can make uh, uh, medicine or anything of that sort. A medicine? Medicine, yeah. Are there instructions in the book how to make medicine? I was going to say, I'm not going to tell you how to make medicine. <laughs> Dave does that in his okay. book. And the whole retail price on this package is $99. What's this piece down here? Yeah, so this last piece here that I so stupidly grazed over. Um, so this is just a, basically a means for you to be able to pick your pot up. Also, if you use the stainless steel bottle and you need to uh, boil some water over the top, you insert this so that you can pick it up, hold it over the fire, and you don't have to try and juggle a hot stainless steel tube between your hands. Very cool. And I'm assuming that the bottle fits inside the cup? It does. It all nests together. Let's verify. Trust but verify. I'm not lying. <laughs> very nice. Thanks for your time, Addison. <laughs> Thank you very much. I appreciate it.